of obsession is something you, you really can't force. You either have it or you don't have it. Um, I would never compare myself to Hunter Thompson. I think that's an unflattering com comparison for any writer, but I think I do a little bit understand what, what he was going through with Nixon. I kind of feel a little bit the same way about Trump. He's a, um, you know, it was kind of hate at first sight, actually, when, when I first saw him on the campaign trail. He's a fascinating, uh, uh, repellent, uh, awful, epically horrible character, and it in a way, it makes for this incredibly engrossing story to follow him. Um, so, you know, I think that, to me, is what really stood out about this last year, is, is Trump himself. He is just such a unique figure uh, in our time. He was, he's kind of the perfect foil to reflect uh, everything that's excessive and vulgar and disgusting and tasteless and cheap and greedy about American culture. Uh, he's the perfect mirror to reflect everything about.